Thank you, Mr. President and uh, distinguished uh, colleagues. Urgent need to stop the Galadima kidnappings and killing fields. The urgent need for security agencies to act. The Senate should observe that the scourge of kidnappings, a prevailing conflict within Nigeria, has penetrated the Federal Capital Territory, FCT, Abuja, undermining the very essence of safety and security. Protests echoing the surge in kidnappings during 2022s spotlighted the worsening situation, emphasizing the indiscriminate nature of these abductions, targeting individuals across various social strata, from politicians to civil civilians, students, security agents, motorists, farmers, faith-based organizations and aid workers. Despite the nation's seat of governance residing within the FCT Abuja, the Kuja Area Council stands notorious for its escalating kidnapping incidents. Also observes that while efforts have been underway to curtail this insecurity, the persistence of the kidnapping menace remains evident. Legislative actions such as the 2022 legislation signed by the Nigeria's president aimed at penalizing ransom payments and abductions, but the efficacy of these measures remains uncertain. According to security forces, out of the 19 abducted, 12 lives have been lost. And seven individuals are still being held captive in a forested area spanning approximately 100 kilometers. Deeply worried that the Failure to urgently address the kidnapping crisis in Nigeria, especially in um, FCT, could result in social unrest, loss of confidence in governance, humanitarian toll, economic decline, increased insecurity, and potential international implications, all of which could profoundly impact the nation's stability, prosperity, and international standing. Accordingly, um, resolves to one, call for a joint operation involving the Army, Air Force, Police, the DSS to intensify the search efforts for the remaining captives. Urge the Inspector General of Police to see to the installation of CCTV cameras in strategic locations within and around Abuja, highways, and other major capital cities to foster surveillance and deter criminal activities. Three, also call on the Inspector General of Police to urgently increase security patrols and surveillance within Abuja and across the nation to proactively combat and prevent further kidnappings. Four, mandate the committees on defense and police to conduct a thorough investigation into these kidnappings and other similar incidents in and around Abuja. Also mandate the aforementioned committees to recommend robust strategies to prevent future kidnappings within FCT. And of course uh, observe one minute silence in honor of the lives lost due to the cruelty of the kidnappers. I so move uh, Mr. President. I rise to support the motion raised by distinguished Senator Ned Woko on the need to stop not just the Galadima kidnappings, but also for the security agents to take necessary action to prevent and deter and catch kidnappers to prevent this from becoming a lucrative business that is spurred by the poverty in the society. I so support, sir. While also supporting this motion, I need to point out that it's not just in Galadimawa. Um, I had occasion to have a discussion last week with uh, Senator Kingiwe. 
several parts of Abuja are under siege. Uh, in, uh, um, part of Lubwe, on the back side of Lubwe, uh, Kubwa, and so forth. So many citizens no longer sleep in their homes. They run into town and go back during the day. So there's something very, very serious going on in around the federal capital territory. In supporting it, Mr. President, I have to say that uh, the security situation in Abuja is grave. Yeah. In fact, it is even beyond that. As my colleague has rightly said, many people are no longer sleeping in their houses because of fear of being abducted. They are helpless. So they need assistance and support. And Mr. President, there is no other place to ginger the security agents than the National Assembly. General prayer and it has been seconded by the Civil Senator Sani Musa that security agencies involved in the fight against kidnapping and terrorism, including the Inspector General Police, should consider installing CCTV cameras in most major cities and locations in Nigeria to avert further kidnappings. Those in support of this additional prayer say aye. aye. Those again say nay. The eyes have it.